Ohio's Mahoning Valley is hopping with one of the hottest musical acts in our state. From Cleveland to Warren, Youngstown, even Chicago, Gary Lee and the Cat Daddies draw a huge audience no matter where they go. So what makes this music so hot? As ONN's Makia Cameron reports, it's the mixture of rock, funk, gospel and blues that keeps folks feeling good. has roots in the deep south. But Gary Lee and the Cat Daddies aren't singing the blues for audiences in New Orleans. Instead, Northeast Ohio. People are people wherever you go. And uh, it's kind of cool that the way the crowds that we get here and how people come up and tell us that they look forward every weekend to coming out. What they're coming to see is something this area hasn't seen or heard for years. A kind of music full of emotion, an escape from life when times get tough. Life around here is tough. People work, you know, um, nine to five hour days. A lot of times they work uh, overtime, and it's, you know, steel mills, GM, Packard, Lord Sons. So around here, people work hard for the money. So our only goal is to just make them feel good. Gary Lee and the Cat Daddy started singing the blues for audiences in Warren three years ago, but his passion for this music began long before that. My sister snuck home a uh, Jerry Lee Lewis rhythm and blues album when I was about five, and, and uh, I just loved something about the sound, man. It just made me feel a certain way. The group is set to release their first CD this June. After that, time will only tell if this Ohio blues sensation has what it takes to hit it big. You know, and in a lot of ways, to me, uh, I've already made it big, you know. I mean, to me, it, it, this is something I love to do. Reporting from Warren for the Ohio News Network, I'm Makia Cameron. All right, thanks a lot, Makia. And by the way, Gary Lee and the Cat Daddies are also working on a movie soundtrack for an independent film that's being filmed in Warren.